tetrahedron from turned rods with rare earth magnets. You can make all the planktonic solids and many other interesting geometric forms using wooden rods with rare earth magnets shaped like these. You need six rods like this to make a tetrahedron and 30 for an icosahedron or dodecahedron. Here's how you make them. Scribe 7 sixteenths on pear wood blocks and saw to width. Then use the chop saw and a stop block to cut exactly to length. Here's a set of more than 30 5 inch blanks. Eyeball the center of the blank and make a divot with the awl. Seat the spherical magnet on wood, not quite touching the cylindrical magnet inside the rod. To reproduce a platonic set, make a set of gauges including a magnetic polarity tester. You need the little bamboo dowels to help seat magnets in the board holes. Gauge or measure the correct depth, set a hard stop on the drill press, and bore a test hole in one wand. Verify the depth you need to seat the magnet and rebore if necessary. Now the other end, aided by the trusty vertical block chain. Okay, here's what we're going to make a bunch of, and here's the lathe set up with a jam chuck and the headstock chuck and the tailstock live center, um, a cone seated in the drilled hole. This keeps the blank perfectly centered on the holes you just bored. Align the tool rest with the lathe ways and make sure it clears the chuck. The slippy mounting forces you to turn with a light touch. You can increase the tension to get a little more grip. Rough the blank to round using the trusty three-quarter inch spindle roughing gouge. shoulders in the center of this very simple turning. Start in the center and work to the end using the versatile spindle roughing gouge. Okay, for the tetranedron you need six turned wands, four of them magnetized north-south, one north-north, and one south-south. And here's one way they go together. For magnet management you need that polarity tester.
With a stack of known polarity, he pushed the bottom magnet into the top board hole, and without rotating either the magnet stack or the rod, insert the top magnet into the bottom board hole. This makes a north-south rod. Tap them home with a plastic mallet and the bamboo skewer. Confirm polarity, mark with a sharpie, and add one drop of superglue to seal in the color. Octahedron. Pentagram. Icosahedron. The five platonic solids. Wood shop. Thank God for wood. <laughs>